everyone and welcome back to Tutorial. In this video, we are going to be discussing Raplet. This is a part 2 video, so if you haven't watched part 1, make sure to go and watch it first. This video is going to cover the core functions such as coding, debugger, and also explaining further about templates. Before we move on, make sure you guys leave us a like and subscribe to our channel. First, start off by learning how to create a Python file. To do this, first log on to your replit.com and then go to your homepage. Click on the Create button and then choose Python as the language. After that, you may change your privacy settings to private or public. After that, click on Create REPL. Once your file is created, you can start coding on the left side of the screen and then after that, it would be projected on the right side of the screen. For example, if you type and print hello world in the left side of the screen, hello world would be printed on the right side of the screen. Raplet also enables you to do basic arithmetic functions and many more just like any other Python ideal software. Next, let us move on to debugging. To do this, first click on debugger button on the left side. Then, add breakpoints throughout your code by pressing the line number on your Python file. Then, click on the run button on the debugger. If you want to go to the next breakpoint, click on next. You could add as many breakpoints as you want. While running debugger, you can also see the variables being introduced such as A and B. Moving on, let us look into templates. First, go back to the main page and then click on a new template. For a custom Discord bot, type in Discord on a template and then select on Discord bot Python starter. After that, adjust the settings and create the REPL. Basic template features and import files are provided along the simple commands. That is all for this week's tutorial. Make sure you guys leave us a like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. We hope this tutorial has been beneficial for you and stay tuned for the next video. Goodbye!